हेलो स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ऑल माई सेल्फ छवि तोमर लेक्चरर इंग्लिश इन डिस्ट्रिक्ट इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ एजुकेशन एंड ट्रेनिंग हापुर गाजीबाद टूडेज क्लास टॉपिक इज लैंग्वेज गेम्स एंड द ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ टीचिंग लैंग्वेज गेम्स आर एज फॉलोज आफ्टर दिस क्लास यू विल गेट टू नो दैट वाई शुड वी यूज गेम्स इन द लैंग्वेज टीचिंग एंड वॉट आर द एडवाटेजेज एंड डिसएडवाटेजेज ऑफ गेम्स How should we select appropriate learning games, and what are some games that can be used, and that could be very helpful in English language teaching for attaining our learning outcomes? So, keeping these objective in mind, let's start today's topic, that is language games. In the process to make education child-centered. different types of methods and techniques have been developed by educationists till now with the use of these techniques a teacher can be successful or you can say very successful in keeping his or her students focused in studies language game is one of the most important technique in teaching linguistic skills and abilities to the students different games are there and you can design your own games also which help to develop language skills in students in a play way method first there is a need to understand what is language games what is language game language games are fun games are also task based in which student have to perform with fun english is a tool for the children to reach a goal that they will decide for their future which is not directly language related means it is related to all the fields of knowledge and craft activities can be very helpful can be one of the great example of a language games as well as songs are also very important in teaching language skills to the students now the next question is what are the characteristics of language games sensky in 2001 list 12 element on the characteristic of language games like they are full of fun language games have a form of play in which student don't suffer anxiety of studies they will enhance students learning in the form of playing every game have certain rules and certain goals of learning every game demand interaction of student and have certain learning outcomes teacher should provide feedback every game is adaptive or you can say flexible for every level of students and every game have a winning state there is always a conflict that motivate student to problem solving and interaction every language game has a story of its own so these 12 elements are fun form of play rules goals interactive outcomes and feedback adaptive win states conflict problem solving interaction and story whatever game you are using in your classroom that should be based on these 12 elements now the next point is why to use language games in teaching learning process in language learning process if we want to provide an easy and relaxed atmosphere to the students in teaching learning process then language games are very important with the help of language games students remember or understand things faster and better so this is the reason for that we should use language games in the classroom now the third point is what are the advantages of using language games in the classroom some points have been given in this slide 
so let's read one by one first is games are full of fun they are away from the usual boring routine of the language classes second point games are motivating they motivate students to participate in teaching learning process point 3 games have some challenges they challenge student to be responsible for their language learning in a new way point 4 games demand interaction each and every students have to interact with either each other while playing or a game or while participating in a game point 5 games give you ample amount of practice in each language skills like speaking writing listening and reading different games can be designed to develop different language skills point 6 language games create a meaningful context for language use point 7 we can use language games in a variety of classroom setting point 8 important concept are taught in an enjoyable and stress free environment these are the advantages of using language games in language learning process now there are some disadvantages of all games also Let's read one by one. First is, it is possible sometimes that a game may be too difficult to understand for students, and it can consume more time. Next point, sometimes it can be too expensive. So you should check first that you have enough fund or not for using that particular game. Point three. in the spirit of winning games at any cost sometime our learning outcomes may be lost point 4 if games are not matching with the assessment test of students then student can get tired over time so these points should be kept in mind while choosing a game for language learning classroom Now the question is how to choose a game A game must be more than just fun It must have learning outcomes of language Second game should have friendly competition It should not hurt anyone's feeling It should increase productivity happiness and result Only then you can say this is a useful game for language learning point 3 all the students should be involved in game point 4 it should focus or encourage student for the use of language a game should be like that will encourage student for the use of particular language for the use of english language point number 5 game should be planned for students to gain learning objective in the game in the end point number 6 game should give students a chance to learn practice or review a specific language material now while teaching english as a second language language games ideas can be used effectively for attaining our objective there are several language games given in this slides let's discuss one by one the first one is puzzles in puzzle you can use crossword logic jigsaw for developing language skills second is board games board games are very helpful you can use board game for developing any skill of language learning third is memory game or you can say memory card you can use memory card for any skill also fourth is whisper whisper 
game is very useful for spelling improvement for pronunciation for better or enhance vocabulary or to enhance vocabulary next is chain spelling chain spelling is a very nice game for improving vocabulary of the students next is describe images dice game these game are very useful for developing speaking skill of the students what if is also very good for developing speaking skill mime and role play you can use these two techniques as language games in the classroom for developing listening and speaking skill of the students so in this class i told you i tell you about the meaning of games characteristics of games aims and objective behind using a game in the classroom advantages and disadvantages and precautions while choosing a game i gave you ideas about some language games that can be used in language learning classroom to improve different language skills of the students that's all for today in next class for this lesson we will study about some language games in detail means games and their procedure how to use or apply those particular games in language classroom like memory game like word association till then do study at home stay home stay safe thank you all